Hi, my name is Jason Albert, owner operator of Rash of Quivers, and today I'm going to teach you how to put a foam bottom in your quiver. This is a little something I learned from Ned Miller at Crow's Head Outfitters. The foam bottom will allow you to dampen the noise of your arrows and also allow you to uh, keep those trade points and broadheads in place. Alright, I picked this up over at uh, Lowe's for five dollars. This is a pair of high density foam knee pads. So you're going to need the knee pads, a scribe, and a razor blade or something to cut with. Alright, for starters we are going to take this elastic strap out of the uh, out of the knee pad. Then we are going to trace the outer circumference of the quiver. We're going to trace the outer circumference, not the inner circumference, because we want this to feel tight. Okay, and then we are going to just cut it open with the razor blade. Using the scribe, I traced the outer circumference of the quiver and I cut it out using a X-Acto knife. Now all we have to do is just shove this right into the bottom of the quiver and because we use the outer circumference as our measuring tool, it'll fit nice and snug on the inner circumference. Alright, we shoved it down to the bottom and using our arrow, we're going to go ahead and make sure it's nice and snug down there. And you can hear it. Hardly any noise at all. Dampens it up real good, and because it's foam, you can go ahead and poke those trade points or broad heads down in there, and that'll keep those from moving around too much. Now, this should last a long while, but the cool thing about it is it's not glued or anything like that. It just fits snug, so if it does get old, you can go ahead and replace it for $5. Once again, I'm Jason Albert from Rasha Quivers. I hope this helped.